That's five things in less than five minutes. Take five. Flashback mode. I lost my page. Man, you shouldn't have got a. You should have got a bookmark. I should have got one of those bookmarks from the bookmark contest. What was the theme for the bookmark contest? The theme was wild for reading. Where'd you get the idea for your bookmark? Uh, it was based on the cheerleader turtles from the movie Shark Tale. Um, Nyan Cap. It's like an internet thing. I saw a cute picture of a lion. <laughs> um, I actually had a shirt that said run on the wild side and someone in my class gave me the idea. You don't know, oh, oh, you don't know you're beautiful if only you saw what I can see. You understand why I want you. It's so nice. We have so many great volunteers. Yeah, they're all from the Ambassadors Club, but who are they? The Ambassadors Club is a uh, club that meets after school. We work on school community service projects. Um, we do the pennies for patients. We can do a canned food drive, teacher appreciation gifts. It's just uh, a feel-good club where kids can come, anybody can join, and uh, spend some time with some people doing good things. Pennies for Patients is uh, sponsored by the Leukemia Lymphoma Society. Leukemia is a type of cancer that affects the cells of our body that make up our blood. And when someone has leukemia, the white cells that help fight bacteria and viruses in our body grow out of control, and so they can no longer do a good job protecting our body. As scary as all this sounds, kids can defeat cancer and go on to live healthy, normal lives. And while they're fighting cancer, kids can still do a lot of the same things that you do. So kids helping kids is a, a really good thing to do. We started a couple weeks ago, and we're going to stop on February the 9th. Uh, we're going to have pie assembly where our members are going to sell raffle tickets. Um, we're going to have a big assembly where we pull num names out of a hat, and those kids get to pie their favorite teacher. It's a good way to make a little bit of extra money and donate it to a good cause. Spell cat. Q U A T. Cat. Quat. What? How do you feel about winning the TRMS Spelling Bee Crown? I feel pretty good. I was second place last year, so I really wanted to uh, come in in at least the top three this year, and I, I ended up winning, so I was really happy about that. Exactly what is your strategy for winning this weekend? I'm just going to do the same thing I did for the school spelling bee. I'm going to study the words and just try to remember them and see how good I do. For those of us who don't understand, what happens if you win this weekend? Um, well, if I get past county, then I would go to state. And if I get past that, then I would go to the national level at D.C. Hey, do you remember that time on Take 5? Oh, wait, we never aired it. Ah, oh, man. I hate when that happens. Maybe it'll show up in the editor's choice. Please bring all money and orders to Miss Nunez by next Wednesday, October 28th. Today is October 28th. Mm hmm So next Wednesday. No, this Wednesday. This Wednesday. Let it go! When I say trail, you say ridge. Trail. What What are you doing? It's Spirit Week. Ready or not, it's Spirit Week. Ugh, it's Monday, but don't sweat it. Hello, it's Tuesday. Taste the Rainbow Tuesday. Fifth grade wears green. Sixth grade wears yellow. Seventh grade wears orange. Eighth grade wears blue. Wednesday. What not to wear Wednesday. Silly mix patch. Thursday. Throwback Thursday. Outfit from your favorite decade or childhood. Friday. Husky Pride. Paw print. I'm Shanley. And I'm Trey. And this is Take 5, working for you.